First major move of the deadline here, as we see Max Scherzer of the Mets, future Hall of Famer, gets moved to the Red Hot Texas Rangers. The Rangers, unfortunately, do have to give up one of their better prospects, Ronald Acuna Jr.'s little brother. He will be going to the Mets. He is a very good double-A talent. He's already got 42 stolen bases, so... This is a really good trade for both teams. Let's break it down. Now, the Rangers will have to pay Scherzer $22.5 million, but the Mets will have to cover the other $35 million plus. Scherzer does have an option in 2024. Like I said earlier, the Texas Rangers do get Luis Acuna. He is a 21-year-old shortstop for... The Texas Rangers double-A team, he had 42 stolen bases so far this year. He is a speed demon, and we potentially will be able to see a matchup of the Acuna brothers, which will be great, and it's in the same division. Now, Luis, unlike his older brother, Ronald, is much more of a speed threat than he is a power threat, and 362 ABs this year. He only had seven home runs with an outstanding 315 average and 42 stolen bases. He's a really good leadoff hitter, I think, and I definitely think he will be able to contribute to the Mets lineup down the road. Now, I think the winner of this trade is honestly both teams. The Rangers need talent now as they are currently... In first place in the AL West, they're going for it all. They got DeGrom, they got now Scherzer, they got Simeon, they got Seager. They got a ton of people. Now their talent, like Adolis, is getting hot. So I definitely think this is a great move for the Rangers as they needed more pitching Beth, if they're trying to win now. But as long as the Mets go, they really needed future down the road. They've got a lot of old guys, so I think this is really good for them to get a really good prospect out of the Rangers and Ronald's younger brother. Now Scherzer has struggled this year. He's got a 401 ERA, unlike himself. Uh, his career ERA is just under three. He's definitely a first ballot Hall of Famer, so... Can't wait to watch what he does in a new squad. Um, his ERA in the last seven days is a one two nine, so he's really been figuring it out. Here in July, he's got 36 Ks and 31 innings. So can't wait to see what Scherzer does on a new squad. Thank you for watching, and make sure to subscribe so you don't miss any trade deadline news as we will be breaking down who we think the winners of each trade are.